I remember, remember the moment. School spirit. Yeah. I wore my PPF yeah. shirt today on purpose. <laughs> Janet, Nicole, and Amanda, QU freshmen, stopped by the bookstore today looking to pick up some championship gear. We'll have to wait one more day for it to arrive. And while these students are filled with pride, a big win on national television can help get the Quinnipiac name out there with potential future students. We do think that it should help us, especially nationally, that may not have heard of Quinnipiac as much. Tom Ella is Quinnipiac's chief experience officer. For us, as we think about admissions, we think that uh, being at a school that's very spirited, very involved, and for students to see this happening on the campus, I think will be a real allure for students to want to be at a place like this. Home to 6,000 undergrads and 3,200 grad students, the Quinnipiac Poll helped put the school land its name on the map. And now the hope is the hockey win can help expand the brand. Certainly in the Northeast, we are well known. But as you think about some of the other areas that we're looking to continue to grow and bring students from, certainly Minnesota, California, Florida, I think we are very uh, poised right now to be prepared for that uh, great group of young people who want to go to a school that's so energized by something like this. And energy students are already feeding off. I think it's a really cool that we're freshmen. We got to see it the first year we were here. And again, this uh, celebration is going to start at 6 o'clock here at the Ice Arena. Organizers tell us once they fill up the seats there, any overflow, they'll move that over into the basketball arena where they'll be able to watch it on the big screen as well. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in Hamden. Matt McFarland, Channel 3, Eyewitness News. All righty. We'll